That is not what the creation wants. You did not come through 400 years of hell, fire, just to be burned up in the fire. There is a different future for you and me, our descendants. It's not, it's not for us to be destroyed. Our future is just beginning. Theirs is ending. And the reason why theirs is ending, because they are unrighteous. Because they're evil and wicked, nasty, filthy, vile, disgusting people. But maybe that's the reason why some of y'all want to stay. Because you're just as nasty and vile and disgusting as they are. So for those of you who have begun, gone beyond unrighteous, filthy, vile, nasty, pugnant behavior, then we need to get together so that we can get on the, on these, what those little ships, the life ships. So when this boat get to sinking, we can get, we can get off and sail to another safer place. It's not for you to be punished. But you know, like they say, bullets don't have no, there's no name on bullets. Bullets fly, fire, bombs drop. So let us try to avoid this bomb. Let us understand. Let us begin to listen. Let us begin to think for ourselves. Because I'm telling you, if we heed the right call, if we understand things in our reality we have a glorious future we do brothers and sisters we as a people have earned it you are so beautiful we are you just don't know how valuable and wonderful you really are just like elijah muhammad said just gotta clean you up just gotta clean you up some and underneath all that filth all that all that bad stuff is a shining diamond, shining ruby. And people fight over gold. People fight over diamonds. People fight over rubies. They put you behind 12 foot of steel to protect you. And see, that's how the world will see you when you come into your real self. And your real self is not a righteous Muslim. And speaking of righteous Muslim, is that really your agenda? Are, are you the nation of Islam? Are you really wanting the liberation of black people? Or are you trying to convert people to a religion? Because if you're trying to convert people to a religion, then I see why things are going the way that it is. And if that's the case, we are on different sides. Because I want the liberation of black people, the freedom of black people, no matter where you are in life, regardless if you married to a white man, regardless to whether you homosexual, tall, woman, male, child, wherever you are in life, I want your freedom. I want justice and equality for you. I don't care if you're a Christian. I don't care if you're a Muslim. There's no secret plan to put you in a place and force religion on you. What's up? So tell us, what is your real agenda? Nation of Islam. Everybody, these black people, descendants of slaves in America, we have no intent to be Muslims or Christians or all these that we are what we are. And as time goes on, after these falsehoods slowly die, we will become the true people who we are. But until then, the, the religious teaching said, come as you are. It didn't say stay as you are, but we, we as a people will not stay as we are. But right now, come as you are. Bring your talent. Bring your opinion. Let us work together and build for our people. All our people, regardless to how they think, what they believe in. Your religious teaching said, come as you are. But as time goes on and we begin to 
work with one another with love and and and, and sharing and and caring all our issues will be dealt with in a loving peaceful cordial manner and we won't stay as we are so I'm not worried about all these different things that y'all worried about right now you worry too much just get yourself together grab your things and let's go it's as simple as that with that said brothers and sisters I hope that uh, you were able to bear with me through this little talk and um, just think about it jot down your comments stop being silent jot down your comments let's talk about it and uh, again thanks to brother Andre for opening to me brother extra extra 100 and uh, shouts out to uh, brother Ruben and brother Michael Freeman sister Brenda sister Fanadia brother David and so many of y'all I mean it's just Woo, I'm just so I'm just so happy to be around friends because it really sucks being around enemies <laughs> Thank you for listening. This is your brother Talik Ibn Ra otherwise known as the black dragon Otherwise known as the mighty mighty angel snub up seven. I am your brother and hopefully your friend angel snub up seven Talik Ibn Ra until next time peace and respect you.